Oh, uh, hey there, Dusa. How's your endless toil treating you? Um, Mr. Hypnos, do you maybe think that you could, you know, uh, keep an eye on the procession line before Lord Hades, like you were supposed to? Oh, um, that's no problem. I can definitely do that. I'll just add it to the list. Um, good, then. Glad we had the chance to chat. Now, maybe get some sleep or something. You look pretty beat. Get on it, Hypnos. Add enough this one. Achilles, sir. I got a relic of some sort out there. A globule of ancient blood which formed after I fought with Megara. Is this really the Titan's blood I found? As far as I know, yes, lad. That it is. Though who's exactly, I'm not so sure. You'd best hang on to it and keep it safe. Your weapons. They shall thirst for it and drink it up. Not yet, perhaps, but soon. Well, I wasn't about to drink it. You call my chambers a mess? Look at your desk, father. Whatever happened to your court musician, huh? Where's his sentencing parchment work? Stuck in Tartarus all because he stopped singing for you on command. My desk is far more organized than you, boy. And if you're so concerned about our court musician, why don't you commute his sentence yourself? Seeing as I haven't gotten around to it yet. Sure, happy to oblige. I'll just ask the house contractor since you're too busy. Contractor, mind locating the court musician's sentence when you get the chance? There we go. What do you want from me? Leave me alone. We have nothing to discuss here anymore. I was just checking up on you. Just let me know if you wanted to talk for any reason. I'm not interested in having company, especially from you. You stay the hell away while I'm off duty. The lounging area within the House of Hades is a dismal place to be, in spite of its intended purpose to enliven the house's grim inhabitants. It's better than nothing. Nix isn't around. I want to go lie down. Darkness is power. Fated list of mine and prophecies. They always come back. You know something, boyo? I think you could do a real number on one of these columns holding up this place and bring the whole thing down in just a few swipes. Boom, boom, boom! And hate to be standing near one of them if you did. Wreck my father's finely crafted architecture every chance I get. That I can do for sure. <laughs> All right, one more time. For me. <laughs> know that I admire your Lord Father very much. For his grim work lets me continue mine. I trust that one day you shall settle your dispute. Kill or be killed.
understanding, you've been blessed already by one of my other nephews, Ares. As you can see, not all of us are cut from the same cloth. And thank the fates for that. It's high tide. Master Chaos, everyone makes offerings to my relatives upon Olympus. I wish to make an offering to you. Thank you for everything. How cruel of you to make attempts to tempt me with material things. You then please in turn allow me this attempt at reciprocity. Master Chaos, thank you. practically unseen, son of Hades. It is quite difficult even for me to sense your presence at times. The Olympians catch their glimpses now and then, but you are always in a shroud. Thus is the influence of Nyx. It shall be so. The fathomless expanses hidden in darkest corners of the underworld stretch well past the notice of Lord Hades himself. And yet, the interfering prince somehow discovers passage there. Wasn't all that hard to find, really. Come on, you. Use this. has a new effect. Might as well. In the name of Hades. Perfect timing. Hey, sir. Hey, sir. Thought this might ease your burden for a while. Now, hold a moment, Highness. I cannot accept something like this. Not without giving back a little something in return, that is. 
Thanks for that, sir. You know, Prince Ed, I'd not expected to run into you again, not after all this time. Something amiss down in the house, or what? Not had much company of late, is all. Well, something's just about always amiss back home, sir. Figured it couldn't hurt to check up on things in Tartarus a bit more frequently. Well, I am grateful for it. I am the old boulder there, in turn. I'm used to going lengthy stretches on my own, but having visitors from time to time would do me well. Makes sense to me. Thanks. Within the depths of Tartarus reside the most wretched of all the shades who linger for eternity within the underworld, whose lord and master is especially unkind to those attempting to cheat death. Lots of wretchedness to go around, I guess. Bye now. Now, hypothetically, if I provided you with, say, a thousand coins, would you be willing to give me a ride in your beautiful boat? Upriver, I should say, specifically. I had to ask. Chaos is giving me the power to crush you doesn't mean they're getting involved with this, does it? You don't know who or what you're dealing with. Ask Nix about them for me sometime. Here, I'll give you a chance to ask her very soon. No 
nowhere to go but up. Be there soon, Bone Hydra. Burn flingers. back here. Majesty. From within a humble residence in Asphodel reverberates the golden sounding voice of Lord Eurydice, who once attempted to escape the underworld and failed utterly. Much You watch yourself, old man. Oh. Eurydice, thank you for making me feel welcome in your pleasant home. Can't say the same for most places I've been lately. I have a small gift I wanted you to have. Oh, that's awful sweet of you, Your Royal Majesty. Bringing me fresh ingredients like this. You know what? Here's something for you to help keep you safe out there. Thanks so much. You look like you haven't eaten since you were here. Huh? I knew it. Why, thank you.
to eat. Got some zest. Let me see. All aboard. back. 